Have you ever seen a clothing brand inspire cult-like devotion in its fans, with people lining up for hours just to get their hands on the latest drops? Welcome to the world of Supreme. Since its inception in 1994, this streetwear brand has grown from a small skate shop in Manhattan to a global phenomenon, with its iconic red box logo becoming a symbol of exclusivity and status. In this video, we'll dive into the fascinating history, financial facts, bizarre moments, and collaborations that have made Supreme one of the most unique and sought-after brands in the fashion industry. So get ready to discover what makes Supreme so special and why its die-hard fans are willing to pay top dollar for a piece of its merchandise. The brand was originally a skate shop located in downtown Manhattan, catering to the local skateboarding community. But as the brand gained popularity, it began to expand and create its own clothing line. The brand quickly became synonymous with the skateboarding culture and soon expanded to the larger streetwear community. Today, Supreme is a global phenomenon with stores located in major cities around the world. Now let's talk about the Durst items. Supreme is known for its limited edition, drops that often fetch astronomical prices on the resale market. One of the most expensive items to ever come out of Supreme is the Louis Vuitton X Supreme Mal Courier 90 trunk, which retailed for $68,500. The trunk, which features the iconic Supreme box logo and Louis Vuitton's signature monogram pattern, was released as part of a collaboration between the two luxury brands. Another notable item is the Supreme X Everlast Heavy Bag, which sold for $4,000 and came with a pair of boxing gloves. These items may seem outrageous, but for die-hard Supreme collectors, they are worth every penny. Speaking of financial facts, Supreme has become a lucrative business with Forbes estimating the brand to be worth over $1 billion. The brand has achieved this by keeping its production numbers low and creating a sense of exclusivity around its products. Additionally, the brand has never spent a dime on traditional advertising, relying instead on its cult following and social media presence to spread the word. In 2017, Supreme sold a 50% stake to the Carlyle Group for $500 million, further solidifying its status as a major player in the fashion industry. Of course, with such a huge following, there are bound to be some bizarre moments in the brand's history. One of the most notable moments came in 2018 when a group of customers camped out in front of a Supreme store for a new drop, only to be pranked by the brand. Instead of releasing a new collection, Supreme instead gave out free branded bricks to the waiting customers. The prank, while frustrating to some, only further solidified the brand's reputation as a cultural phenomenon. Now, let's talk about the owners of Supreme and their vast fortunes. As mentioned earlier, James Jebbia is the founder of Supreme and currently serves as the brand's CEO. His net worth is estimated to be around $70 million, in 2017, when the Carlyle Group bought a 50% stake in the brand, it was reported that Jebbia made over $100 million from the sale. Additionally, in 2020, VF Corporation, the parent company of brands such as Vans and the North Face, acquired Supreme for $2.1 billion. This acquisition has further increased the net worth of Jebbia and the other owners of Supreme. Finally, let's talk about the collaborations that have made Supreme so famous. Over the years, the brand has teamed up with a variety of high-profile artists, designers, and brands to create some of the most sought-after collections in the fashion world. Some of the most notable collaborations include partnerships with Nike, Louis Vuitton, and the North Face. Additionally, the brand has worked with popular musicians such as Michael Jackson, the Rolling Stones, and Nas. These collaborations have not only been financially successful for Supreme, but have also helped to solidify the brand's place in popular culture. One of the most iconic Supreme collaborations was with artist Barbara Kruger in 2013. Kruger is known for her provocative and thought-provoking artwork, which often features bold, red text over black and white imagery. The collaboration between Kruger and Supreme featured a series of clothing items with the artist's signature text including a hoodie with the phrase, Belief plus doubt equals sanity written on the back. The collection was a hit among Supreme fans and helped to further elevate the brand's reputation as a cultural force. In recent years, Supreme has continued to expand its collaborations beyond the fashion industry.
In 2019, the brand teamed up with Oreo to release limited edition cookies with the iconic Supreme logo imprinted on them. The release caused a stir among both cookie enthusiasts and Supreme fans alike, with the cookies selling out almost immediately. Despite its astronomical success, Supreme has faced criticism over the years for its high prices and perceived lack of diversity. The brand has also faced accusations of copying designs from smaller independent brands. However, despite these criticisms, the brand remains a major player in the fashion industry and a cultural touchstone for a generation of young people. As Supreme continues to evolve and expand, it will be interesting to see where the brand goes from here. The recent acquisition by VF Corporation has raised questions about the future of Supreme, with some fans worrying that the brand's sense of exclusivity and authenticity will be lost under a larger corporate umbrella. However, VF Corporation has stated that they plan to allow Supreme to continue operating independently, with founder James Jebbia remaining at the helm. And there you have it, the fascinating world of Supreme. From a small skate shop in Manhattan to a global phenomenon, this brand has solidified its place in fashion history through its limited drops, lucrative business strategies, and high-profile collaborations. Despite criticism and controversy, Supreme has maintained its status as a cultural touchstone, inspiring a devoted following of fans around the world. With its recent acquisition by VF Corporation, only time will tell what the future holds for this iconic brand. Thank you for watching.